Several signs over the last week have pointed to Anthony Joshua and Deontay Wilder finally putting pen to paper on a heavyweight contract. WBN now understands that a two-fight agreement could be sealed this month for what could be the most lucrative top division battle in the history of the sport. On the back of Wilder upping the stakes with a $50 million offer to Joshua, the pair's teams have knuckled down in a bid to seal a huge doubleheader on both sides of the Atlantic. Joshua looks set to defend his titles against Wilder in the United Kingdom this summer, and dependent on the original result, will then give the American home advantage for a return in Las Vegas or New York later in the year. Pay-per-view platforms at Showtime and Sky Sports box office are already on board, with the finer points of the deal being ironed out before an official confirmation can be made. Alexander Povetkin, the current WBA and WBO mandatory challenger, will be forced to wait his turn as both organizations allow the fans to witness the biggest 200-pound-plus bout in almost two decades. A consolation prize, potentially a regular WBA or interim WBO title shot, alongside a hefty monetary compensation will help Povetkin and his promoter in their delay as Joshua and Wilder fight it out for all the major marbles on offer. Making the clash an undisputed affair is key to both Joshua and Wilder, whilst profits from the event will almost double from interest generated in the first such clash since Lennox Lewis v. Evander Holyfield in the late 1990s. With all going eerily quiet in the media of late, WBN has been informed talks are at a delicate stage as boxing braces itself for a major development in the coming days. Wembley Stadium is already being penciled into stage the first meeting, with the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas handily leading the Barclays Center in Madison Square Garden as the New York options.